This is uh, Birth of Britain, Chapter 15, the first half, Magna Carta. So, there was this person named King John, well, named John, and he swore his fealty to the king, king of France. Why are you taking a picture, Mom? I didn't. I, I'm not taking a picture. He swore his fealty to the king of France, and so once he had power in England, the king of France asked for some of the power. And he said no, and the king of France asked him to attend court there, probably so that he could press charges against him and find him guilty and kill him. But he said no, he wouldn't come, so all his lands in France were gone, but he was king of England. And he was this, um, I don't know how to describe him with any words other than shithead. But uh, be a little more creative than that, please. I can't be more creative. I don't. You can. I don't know any more words. Then obviously we need a thesaurus. We looked at we looked at those words, right? He was immoral, oh, yeah. degrading. Oh yeah, he was immoral, degrading. All. <laughs> yeah, he. But he was really smart, and so he was fighting against the king of France. And King, there was another king called King Arthur. He was his equal, and he was fighting against King Arthur. He eventually got him captured and got him castrated, and King Arthur died from the shock. And then everyone was mad at him if they weren't already. And so, basically, his downfall began, and he died, I think. Who died? King John. Not yet. Oh, he was gonna die, though. Well, yeah. Everybody does in history. Yeah, I guess. But, but like... But not yet. Yeah, he was gonna... He was gonna get killed. All right, well, we'll see. We'll see if he... We'll see what happens. Because this is a part way through the chapter. Okay. 